and welcome back to Vicky's Theories. In today's video, we'd like to talk about Stray Kids Ordinary Trailer, focusing on a little breakdown and analysis of the video to see what it can tell us about this upcoming comeback. Now, in this brand new cinematic trailer, Stray Kids have announced their return with a new and odd chapter of their story. This time around, the protagonist of this adventure seems to be none other than Felix, who, as always, seems to know something that we don't. At the beginning, the video opens with a wide shot of a metropolis and Felix crossing the street against the floor while playing with a padlock. In the video, we see him locking it and unlocking it as the flicking sound becomes more and more prevalent, so right off the bat, we can say that this opening already sets the tone for the comedy as a whole. Now, to be honest with you, this very first introduction to the concept actually reminded me a lot of Vincenzo, because in that drama, Vincenzo has a lighter and he fidgets with it in a very similar way. In the video, the lighter is obviously replaced by a padlock, but this little reference might actually help us set the scene for the journey to come. Whether this is the case or not, however, the fact that Felix is carrying a padlock is an interesting detail in and of itself, especially if we consider Stray Kids concept as a whole. You see, even if in the last few comebacks their storyline evolved quite a bit, for the longest time their entire concept revolved around keys, to the point that they even had a whole series dedicated to them. In the class series, keys were basically everywhere, and on many occasions the members needed these keys to either access or escape specific stages of their journey towards the new world. Now, however, it's the opposite, because the focus is not on a key, but rather on a padlock. This is an interesting contrast that might actually imply that this time around, Felix will need to lock a door instead of opening it. If this is the case, however, then we need to understand what door we are actually talking about, and this is where things start to get odd. You see, as the video progresses, we get the sense that Felix is a man on a mission. While he travels through the city, we see some posters that actually foreshadow that he is alone because his members went missing. His search for the others eventually leads him to an ordinary shop, but when he goes through the back door, this ordinary shop becomes an ordinary shop instead. Now, the fact that things start to get odd the moment Felix crosses the back door might actually imply that this is the door that he has to close, but achieving this task is easier said than done, because before he knows it, he actually has a series of very strange encounters. You see, as it turns out, the seven members that he was looking for did not go missing, but they rather went odd. We have Lino surrounded by tin cans who attacks Felix with a golf club, but then we have Han surrounded by clocks and Bang Chan with bones tattooed on his hands. Then we see Chan being teleporting with his own portable mood light, Su Min popping out of nowhere to get pictures, and Ayan surprising Felix while he is inspecting a mysterious dark room. Last but not least, however, Felix is eventually approached by Hyun Jin, who actually asks him if he wants to be ordinary and seemingly pushes him out of the window. Now, even if Felix Felix seems to be channeling his inner Gwen Stacy in this scene, his fate is yet to be seen, because to be honest with you, this final scene can be interpreted in different ways. One possibility, for instance, is that what we are seeing might actually be a dream or a vision. Maybe this ordinary shop is able to alter your perception of reality, and if this is the case, then Felix might be hallucinating a fall that is not actually taking place. Another possibility, however, is that maybe we need to see this scene in a more metaphorical way, in the sense that maybe it represents Felix's downfall in an ordinary world. Since Hyunjin asked him if he wanted to be ordinary, maybe the fall might lead him to transform into the odd version of himself, and if this is the case, then this fall might symbolize the death of the ordinary Felix and the birth of the ordinary one. If we take a look at the posters, for instance, before the other members went missing, they were all portrayed as very ordinary individuals. They dressed like anybody else, they didn't accessorize, and all in all, they seemed pretty regular boys living in a pretty regular world. Now, however, they pull a Versace robe on a Thursday, you feel me? They dress like they want, do what they want, act like they want, and apparently teleport how they want as well, all of which is very odd compared to their past. For this change to take place, maybe the other members had to go through what Felix is going through as well, and if this is the case, then this seemingly fatal fall might actually be none other than a rite of passage of some sort. Now, since in their latest comebacks, Stray Kids have been heavily inspired by comic books, a very good example of what might actually be taking place is actually Catwoman. You see, in the comic book, her origin story is that Selina Cal falls to her death and she's essentially reborn as Catwoman. A similar occurrence that does not involve death instead could actually be Harley Quinn, because in her origin story, the Joker makes her fall into acid and she becomes a supervillain from that moment on. 
Whether we're talking about an actual death or a metaphorical one, both these transformations are the result of a fault that essentially kills the ordinary version of these women for the ordinary version to be born. Maybe the trailer is actually showing us something similar happening to Felix as well, but to know whether this is the case or not, we'll have to wait and see. But what do you think? Did Yunjin push Felix? Did he fall himself? What is happening? Let me know in the comments down below. In the meantime, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please think about liking and subscribing as always thank you so much for watching guys i'll see you next time bye, -bye.